Okay, bitch. <clears throat> These three little boxes. Oh, let's turn it around. Three little boxes. All spider coes. The top one here is the spider co ambitious. It's a great little blade. <clears throat> and the reason it's ambitious is for such a small blade, it's got to be ambitious, right? To do more, to be more. And actually, it's it's pretty good. I like it a lot. <clears throat> not bad steel. Um, it's not the best steel, but it's very sharp. Holds an edge. It's a, a flat grind. Uh, it's okay slicer. Recommend it, right? And it's not that expensive. <clears throat> These ambitious is uh, is pretty good. It locks up with a little uh, with a little thing right here, so you have to pull that thing in to close it. So I recommend it. These two are the Chaparral. It's the smallest of the gentleman folders. This one here I've been carrying for a number of years and made in Taiwan. It's got a nice jimping here and a jimping here. Great handles. It locks up uh, back here. Taiwanese steel. Typical Spyderco upper level kind of shit. Um, recommend it. Here, new in the box, even with the little piece of shit thing here, <coughs> another chaparral. It's stiff. It's never been used. Never been out of the box. Same as this one. Same thing. I, I thought I lost it, so I liked it so much, I ordered another one, and then I found it. So. This one's just been sitting in the box. It's the little brother of the sage. They call it the gentleman folder. And I have to say, it's gentleman's folder. Super nice blade for everyday carry. I don't think there's a better blade out there for that purpose. Oh, a lot of blades that are good. This one will fit the bill perfectly. Highly recommend it. Spyderco Chaparral with a big asshole. Okay, bitches?